Hi Virgo, it's Ellie. Welcome to my channel and welcome to your reading. Now let's begin. I've already cleansed the space and I've meditated on your cards. This reading is good for your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And if this reading resonates for you, please give this video a thumbs up. And leave a comment down below how it resonated for you. I want to say thank you to each and every one of you who has liked, shared, and subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much for supporting me here on YouTube. And thank you for supporting other tarot readers on YouTube as well. I'm now accepting personal readings, so if you are interested in booking a personal reading with me, all you have to do is click on the link in the description box down below. Alright, the King of Pentacles as your overall energy. Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles. Alright. The Knight of Wands. Alright. The Four of Swords. And then the Temperance. For some reason, I... They want me to do this. Anyway. The Six of Swords. The Three of Cups. And then the Three of Pentacles. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Give me a few seconds. I want to straighten up my seat. All right. Virgo, your overall energy is the king of pentacles. Underneath the deck is the hermit. It's still your card. All right. You feel very isolated right now. Maybe you're focusing on your job. You're focusing on your money. All right. For some of you, you have, could have divorced someone. Right? That's why you're focused on your money because it has depleted for some of you, if, of course, if you divorce someone. Of course, if you divorce someone, it, it means, you know, some some part of your money or most of your money has, uh, has been gone, has been split to someone else, you know, given to someone else, given to that person. All right, but right now you're very much focused on your job, your money, your career. But in no time, you will get back whatever you lost, all right? You will regain that stability. No doubt, you will regain that stability. For some of you, you know, I obviously I'm connecting to a Virgo whose masculine energy is more dominant than their feminine energy, all right? Remember, we both we have both masculine and feminine, feminine energies within us. One is just more dominant than the other, all right? So I'm dealing with someone who has more dominant masculine energy. So, you're wanting to find someone eventually who is as stable as you. For some of you, I'm getting that you were, you divorced someone, you were with someone who was in it for the money. All right? Please don't shoot the messenger when I say this. It's just something that I've been picking up on. Some of you, you were dealing with someone or you were with you were in a connection where the other person was all about the money. They they loved nice things, all right? And I'm sorry if I had to say it that way. I'm not here to, you know, to just give you rainbows and unicorns. You have the Ten of Pentacles to the Six of Swords. Yes, yes, yes. You were in a connection with someone. Uh... Yeah, but now you're moving on. You're moving away from this person. You could have divorced them, all right? For some of you, you could have separated. For some of you, you thought that this was something stable and secure. Like, uh... Like it could go long... That it... Like it could go long term. But eventually, it didn't. I'm sorry about that. I really am. 
but uh, there are better days ahead for you, I have to say. Better days ahead. The Knight of Wands to the Three of Cups. Yeah, this person, for some reason... Alright, male, female, it's not really gender-specific reading. But the Knight of Wands is someone who... I'm really getting... Uh, kind of played you. Alright, kind of played you. You were dealing with someone who... Might have... Uh, might have committed to you legally and in paper but very much uh non-committal acting like they were single all right with the the the, <laughs> the three of cups there yeah someone put you in a third party relationship someone had a third party relationship gold digger i have to say you were dealing with a gold digger that's gonna be the title <laughs> right now you're resting you're rejuvenating you're being patient with yourself you're being nice to yourself actually you're being kind to yourself uh you're just taking this as a lesson you will eventually be with the right person the right commitment someone who will work with you to build this relationship this is someone who's going to be patient with you what is the outcome You have the four, the nine of swords, the four of wands. The emperor, and then the six of cups. All right, okay. Page of cups underneath the deck, you know. Very new, very much new love coming in. Very much new love coming in. Okay. You have the Emperor card, the Four of Wands, the Nine of Swords, and then the Six of Cups. You're doubting this connection that's coming in. You've, you're thinking, you're anxious about it. You're thinking that it might just end up like the last one. But no, this is commitment coming in. Someone who, I'm really getting someone who's a boss like you. Male, female, not really a gender specific reading. We're looking at the energies, but uh, yeah. I'm also getting you will take charge in this relationship that's coming in. Four of wands, this is my halfway to marriage. Also my 11-11 card, so make your wish. But uh, this is someone who will commit to you fully. So it's not like someone from your past. It's not like the Knight of Wands who was playing you. All right. Advice. The World card, the Queen of Pentacles. If you could see, you have the Queen of Pentacles and then the King of Pentacles. You have a match there. All right. You could be traveling, traveling the world or the advice for you is to travel and see the world. All right. Meet new people. But you will eventually end up with the right person just believe that you will end up with the right person someone who's as stable as you and i'm really getting asked to the universe for the right person to come in ask the universe for the right person to come in ask the universe that the next person who comes in is really that one for you all right to guide you towards that person 
beautiful reading. That is all I have for you, Virgo. I hope something in this reading resonated, and if it did, please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below how it resonated for you. I love you all so much. I'll see you in the next reading, and stay blessed.